another one that's uh I was talking to some children about uh, animals that mate for life. These animals, once they find a, a wolf that finds another wolf, that's it. So far, so that's good. their their mate for life. Uh, and I I was actually uh, under the impression that penguins were part of this, uh, but actually they're on the one year plan. Uh, but for one year they are they are true and faithful. Um, and I was asking children if they any, knew any more of the five uh, animals that I knew that made it for life. And one little boy said, anacondas. Because that's a snake. And I said, really, anacondas? And he says, king cobras too. So I decided I would just take the little boy's word for it. I didn't look it up on the internet to see if it was true. Um, so I wrote this song called Forever Love. And uh, we just worked on the chorus. So we'll see how it goes. The chorus which you can sing uh, is uh, goes like this. Love forever, love forever, love forever. Let's try it together. Love forever, love forever, love forever. Start with the anaconda. Let's do it. Mother and her newborn child, wolves that wander in the wild, dolphins swimming in the sea. It's how I want the world to be. I guess I caught a case of cutes like penguins in tuxedo suits, where geese are flying high above. There's room for more forever love. is true blue so lovingly it squeezes you king cobra on the other hand prefers the fruit of lotus land while whales are dreaming of don juan behold the swans of babylon my mammoth and the matching love for her it was forever love forever love forever Turn the other cheek For peace on earth was unheard of Until they tried forever love As you go down the waterfall Just in time a falcon's claw The blessed beast would not let go Until you stand safe below They're waiting in the fox's den Is just the one to lick your chin Break of day and morning dove is omen of forever love. Forever love. Forever love. Forever love. Forever love. Forever love. Surprise here. Now anybody else who wants to do it, there's still open Good books work. there. We've still got a little more time. Squirrel surprise. Looks like a robot with a squirrel holding a, a nut. Uh, and then the robot is holding the nut. And, uh, and it looks like the robot has, uh, well, there must be 
Yeah, the robot has kind of eyelashes. It might be a female robot. I'm not sure. Um, and then it looks like the robot's got a stomach, uh, got a mouth in its stomach, and it's taken the um, acorn and put it into its stomach there. And the, the squirrel's mad. Wow. Page four, the squirrel scoots off. And um, the robot puts his hands like this. So I'm going. And then the squirrel looks like its heart's broken. It's starting to cry because the squirrel's gone away in a tip. Then the squirrel comes back with an acorn. And you see the, the feet of the um, robot. And looks like it's giving it to the uh, robot. And the, ro and the squirrel's in love with the robot. And the robot's in love with the squirrel because they got all these ha hearts. Finally, on page eight, BAM! <laughs> It was a, uh, looks like a, you know, a little, little explosion, and the acorn apparently was a, um, uh, uh, an explosive acorn, and so that's called a squirrel surprise. I did not expect that. I did not expect that. Who did that? Who did that? Well, in the yellow shirt here. All right, that's, that, that could be your first book. All right, now we got another one here. Um, looks like there's a ship. And, and there's something floating out on the ocean. And then there's a house. Could be a mouse. And then it goes past. It's upside down. Oh, it goes, it's, it's goes on. It's called the Moby Dick. And it gets on the ship, or gets off the ship. I'm not sure. And it goes under a bridge. Oh, it's an incomplete one. Okay, well, somebody will finish it. Let's do, um... Let's do another one. Now, if there's anybody who wants to help me make up a verse to this song, this is uh, 